Hi, my name is Heather from Fleet Feet. One of the most common things that we hear when people come in for shoes at Fleet Feet is that they pronate. Well, guess what? We all do. So what does that have to do with choosing a running shoe? In this video, we're gonna unlock that. So I already said that everybody pronates, but what is pronation? Pronation is basically just the movement of your foot. But what we're really concerned with when we're fitting you for shoes is just how flexible or rigid your foot is. So someone who's heard that they overpronate likely has a more flexible foot. Whereas someone who's heard that they supinate or that they just have a neutral foot has a more rigid foot. So back in the 80s, when running became really popular, we saw a lot more people out on the roads. With a lot more people out on the roads, we saw a lot more injuries. That's when the stability category was born. Stability shoes were designed with the idea that they would help to decrease those injuries. But as years have gone by, there really is no correlation between stability shoes and a decrease in injuries. As a result of that, footwear technology is evolving and we have a lot more options based on the way that your foot moves. So neutral or stability or somewhere in between. Let's break it down. So first, we've got our neutral shoes. A neutral shoe is gonna be a little bit more flexible and is gonna be great for someone whose foot is a little bit more rigid. Remember, opposites attract. In addition to being a little bit more flexible, a neutral shoe is gonna have even cushioning throughout the midsole. So what about our friends with more flexible feet? Let's talk modern stability shoes. These shoes are gonna be a little bit more rigid and have reinforcement on the inside of the shoe. And some of them use guide rail technology, which is basically like bumper bowling for your feet. They're gonna keep your foot locked in and moving exactly the way it needs to. So why would you need reinforcement on the inside of your shoe? If you have a flexible foot, you'd be more likely to prematurely wear down the inside of your shoe unless you have that extra reinforcement. So that extra reinforcement is gonna to help to make your shoe last longer. And then there are some shoes that can do it all, like the Asics Gel Nimbus 25. This shoe is a neutral shoe, but it's pretty rigid. So it's gonna work really well for our friends who have more flexible feet and it's gonna be great for someone who has a more rigid foot because of the even cushioning throughout the midsole. So which one is right for you? Fleet Feet Outfitters are trained to analyze the way your foot moves and will help you to find the perfect fit for you.